What is up you guys, it's Valek Telly here and welcome back to the channel, let's catch a vibe. Now, I hope everyone's feeling great, feeling amazing, feeling vibey. Without further ado, let's get straight to the point. You guys have seen Green Goblin has just dropped straight away in the item shop as I did my video. And yeah, we're pretty much going to be covering him in this video. And don't forget, as I always do with these videos, it's like a bundle review slash overview slash is it worth it. And off the bat, we don't even need to go through the whole video. It is 100% worth it if you're a big fan of Marvel, if you're a big fan of the recent Spider-Man No Way Home. But anyway, I'm going to give you guys the lowdown. So let's jump straight in and let's check out the brand new Green Goblin. So jumping straight in with the skin itself, we have the Green Goblin. He won't rest until he's destroyed Spider-Man. <laughs> he won't rest. I mean, base skin design, looks just like the old fashioned classic goblin from the animated spider-man cartoons we all grew up with especially if you grew up with the one in the 90s but yeah i love the base design they've kept the armor plating on, on some of him as well really like it or the shall i say the chain mail on some of him pretty damn cool i like the base design anyway moving on to the bat bling we have the pumpkin bomb norman's favorite now in a convenient obviously quotes Destroy everything size. <laughs> Can Spider-Man come out to play? <laughs> Sorry guys, I get a bit carried away. Anyway, moving on to the emote, we have Arm the Pumpkin. Hope you brought enough to share. I love that I love that the pumpkin laughs, man. <laughs> Anyway, moving us on to the Harveston tool, we have the Pumpkin P-Axe. Practical? No. But staying on theme is so important for a supervillain. I mean, like I said in the item shop, I ain't gonna lie. It's not practical, but staying on theme is pretty much what you have to do as a supervillain. Even with the puns, I mean, you can't call yourself, you know, Green Goblin if you're not about pumpkins or goblin kind of stuff. Anyway, pretty damn cool though. I definitely recommend grabbing this, guys. Moving us on to the glider, which I'm glad they kept the OG style. We have the Green Goblin Glider. Perfect for dragging a friend on a trip around the city. <laughs> if you guys didn't know and you haven't seen No Way Home by now, obviously, or you don't know much about Green Goblin, obviously he's mo one of his most famous things to do is whip Spider-Man with like a grappling hook and tie him and just, just drive him around the city with a grappling hook attached to him. It's so funny, but it is pretty cool. I, like I said, I'm glad they kept the OG design for it. But yeah, it is pretty damn cool. I believe this has got like a new animation to it as well, or a new gliding style. Anyway, moving us on to the loading screen, we have the attack of the goblin. Does he make you smile? Forget it. Cheese! Absolutely amazing. I want to preference this that you can't get this or obtain this without buying the bundle, as I always try and do with some of my bundle videos. Anyway, we have the attack of the goblin. Jeez. We've got some familiar skins there. We've got the pumpkin king in the back. We obviously, we've got the green goblin bursting out of like a skylight and Spider-Man's caught him. <coughs> we have the skin on the left, which escapes me at the moment, but I know it came out in chapter two, t chapter two, season two. You already know that was my favorite season. And we have the llama there, which is part of the renegade set, I think. I just know it was had, it had like, a bat bling that had like pouches on it and stuff i'll remember it anyway but yeah pretty damn cool we have the attack of the goblin but what you guys are here for if you guys are here for my opinion is it worth it a thousand percent i wouldn't even hesitate not to grab this grab this for damn sure but yeah guys just wanted to do my little bundle review and overview i was right when i said it was a new glider animation which is pretty damn cool but yeah, if you guys are fresh off the heels of watching the brand new Spider-Man No Way Home, which is only, what, a month old, two months old now, I definitely recommend grabbing these and showing support because we want more skins like this. We've got Venom, we've got Green Goblin now, like, we've got the Tom Holland Spider-Man, like, I would love to see a Sandman skin, maybe a Doc Ock skin, which would be pretty cool. But anyway, I'm going to end this video here, guys. If you guys did like this video, don't forget to smash the like button. If you didn't enjoy the video, don't forget to smash the dislike button and let me know in the comments down below why you didn't like, why you didn't like the video. Subscribe to the channel if you're new and join Team Let's Catch a Vibe. And hopefully if you guys did enjoy this video, please don't forget to switch on the bell notifications to get no fun as soon as uploaded. But more importantly, don't forget to stay the vibe and I'll catch you in the next episode. Peace. <laughs>